Here's the first ball of the Pakistan inning. Steve Harmison carved away over backward point for four. That'll set the tone for Pakistan's run chase. Great shot, clipped away. Another boundary for Pakistan. Ball in, dragged it on. The Anderson knack has not deserted him. Gets a wicket in his first over. A little bit of luck, but you make your own luck in this game. Run Akmal has gone. Playing on to Jimmy Anderson. He won't get away with too many ball there either. Crashed away for four. Glorious. In his car in on the act now. Four more to Pakistan. Really starting to rev up, and they're 33 for one. Timing, all timing. On the up this time through extra cover. Successive boundaries for Yunus Khan of Stephen Harmison. One and a half volley, and one just pure, purely timed. Brilliant. Don't see many better shots than that in world cricket. And that's uh, away for six over deep backward square, and the 50's up. gone through, it's Harmison who has to retrieve the ball from the boundary that's gone through mid wicket this time, another boundary and he gets another one three in a row crowd rows Pakistan 66 for one hit very crisply one bounce over that holding board Salman Bhatt is enjoying this 141 now of just 37 balls that's put away all mid that is what can happen to you give a run an easy run to a batsman the man on strike can put away an easy ball which Yunus Khan did Well, that's hit very hard. No need to run for that one. It's travelled all the way. Mighty straight hit for a six. Well, that's his 50. 50 in 47 deliveries, Salmon, but seven fours, one six. Well, they love it. What a shot to bring up your 50. Third ODI 50 for Salman, but he's an emerging player, good talent for Pakistan. 50 from just 47 balls. Will that be declared a wide? It is. That's gone for another boundary. Even though Anderson is giving it, giving it a chase, but that ball once again rushes away at lightning speed. the four it came off an outside edge but they all clap because it, it is a boundary and a crucial one there it is a well made 50 for Yunus Khan coming back after missing the last test match his 21st one day international 50 Well played, uh, Yunus Khan. Rightly, rightly timed 50. Pakistan really needed somebody come in number three and build the inning. And he has done really well. Just faced 46 deliveries with five fours and one six. In the air and straight to mid-off. 
So Harmison comes back for his second spell, gets a wicket of the first ball. And the third power play has worked in England's favour. This is artistry from Yunus Khan. Square drive of a slow ball for four is a difficult shot. It's 142 for two. Should be four. That's his strength. That's one area you don't bowl to, Mohamed Yusuf. Overpitched, angled onto his pads. Poor bowling from Harmison. Oh, good looking shot. Beautiful timing on it. Three fielders after it. None will get to it. Gone. What a wicket that is. Yunus Khan is walking back. As Collingwood at point has taken a catch. And Flintoff gets a wicket. He's picked that up pretty well. A wonderful little wristy flick from Interman. Gets him his first boundary. Yeah! It's an edge yet. Interman has gone. That's a good catch. A little bit of a juggle by Geraint Jones. Collingwood has broken through. That is a really, really big wicket for England. The Pakistan talisman, the captain, has gone. Beautifully timed, just held the ball on its way, what a shot. There's his 50. Fifty-one not out is Mohamed Yusuf. His 44th one-day international 50, Pakistan 245 for four. in the air and there's a cry of catch and Solanke's under it and caught it good catch, nothing is easy under lights in the mist and murk and Solanke has done really well and Mohamed Youssef has gone and given Liam Plunkett his first wicket in one day international cricket it's in the air and over mid wicket it's a favourite area Looks to hit straight in that wide V between mid-wicket and extra cover, and he started early here. Three balls faced, one boundary. Clubbed away, flat batted. Six. Well, it's all happening here. This crowd once again comes alive. joins the party and want two and get two Shahid Malik goes to 50 off just 59 balls Sixteenth uh, one day 50 for Shahid Malik no fours, no sixes testimony to uh, how workmanlike he's been Lower ball, is there an edge? There is. Up goes Daryl Hare's finger. Liam Plunkett has got rid of the danger man. Abdul Razak caught behind for 13. It's up in the air. Jones is under it. Well, he's got it. Cool, heart in your mouth time. Just goes to show how difficult it is out there for batsmen and fielders, but Jones has got the catch. And Shoaib Malik has gone. Rana Naveed is the new batsman. Jones in the action again, and could this be a run out? England players think there's a chance here gut feeling is yes this is run out third umpire will need another look at this the bells are in the air the bat is short 
Shoaib Akhtar is the batsman desperately trying to get in there. Red lights up already, and that's another for England. Dejection from Shoaib Akhtar. Crowd has gone very, very quiet. Gone now, caught extra cover. Triscothic takes the catch. Flintoff hardly has the energy to celebrate. Pakistan are nine down, and England are nearly there. And that's it. Just about the perfect in-swinging.